welcome to the replay. Hey guys, while I'm behind the scenes getting everything ready for your viewing pleasure of the upcoming project, here are some things that you can do. Number one, if you are not already following me on Facebook or YouTube or Instagram, be sure that you go ahead and you like my fan page on Facebook, that you follow my page on YouTube, and that you follow me on Instagram. And make sure your notifications are turned on on all of those sites, so that way you never miss an announcement that I have have to make about products that could be coming out or when I'm getting ready to go live or if there's specials that I'll have going on where you'll want to go into my VIP group. Which brings me to that. My VIP group link is right down below in the description of the video on both YouTube and Facebook. If you're not already in there, I would love it if you would go ahead and join my VIP group. It's a great place to be, you guys. Next thing I want to talk to you about is Club Couture. If you haven't already heard, Club Couture is the hottest DIY home subscription service out there, bringing DIY creativity to your door every single month. It's only $19.99 plus tax in the US and $26.99 plus tax in Canada. And guess what? It's going to ship free to you every single month. What will ship free to you? Well, an exclusive size B transfer that only Chalk Couture designers and Club Couture customers can receive once they become a Club Couture customer and three coordinating Chalk Piece singles. Don't worry about seeing the Club Couture transfer right now in this part of the video because I'll be showing you once we start the live. You will also gain access to my private Club Couture VIP group, where I go and create three additional projects every single month without fail to give you the most bang for your buck with that Club Couture transfer. You'll also get bonus flat rate shipping. I'll go over that as well once we go into the project. But just know you're going to get bonus flat rate shipping of $4.95 in the US and $9.95 in Canada. It's pretty awesome. You will also get access to exclusive offers and deals directly from Chalk Couture each month for being one of my Club Couture customers. Now, we're going to go ahead and we're going to be talking about the opportunity to go ahead and purchase your business in a box, launch your empire, and join my award-winning team. Stay tuned for that. So, hope you're ready for the project that's about to come. Thanks for watching, guys, and thanks for joining me today. Hey, hey, you guys. Happy Watts of Love Wednesday. Um, and I'm also going to say welcome to anybody who is friends with me on my personal page because since this is for a good cause, I shared it to my personal page. I don't often do that, but um, I can't actually remember the last time I did, but that's okay because we're doing it for something good. So I'm going to do um, some of the important things before we get into the real fun and important things. So, um, I want to talk chalk, uh, Club Couture tonight first, obviously, because Club Couture is something that is super amazing. As you heard in that little video, it is the best DIY home decor, um, subscription service out there. It brings DIY creativity to your door every single month without fail. Um, it is a small monthly fee of $19.99 plus tax in the U.S., $26.99 plus tax in Canada, and it will ship free to you every single month. What's going to ship free to you? Well, this is February's Club Couture, so if you sign up this month, which I really encourage you doing so, this is the transfer you will get. They go confidently along with three coordinating chalk paste singles. Now, that's not all that you get with Club Couture. You will also get exclusive flat rate shipping on every single order that you do, no matter how many items are in there. The flat rate shipping is $4.95 in the U.S. and $9.95 in Canada. You will also get exclusive access into my private Club Couture group where I go live, or I'm sorry, where I make three additional projects every single month without fail to give you the most bang for your buck with this monthly transfer. You will also now, something brand new that started, once you join Club Couture, you will get the brand new um, semi-annual catalog that we are in. So this month, if you join or if you join during this period, you're going to get the spring, summer 2021 catalog. And you guys, it's a beauty. If anything, use it as an idea book. It is so, so good. And also this month, if you join, you will get, we are launching our brand new creamy, dreamy chalk paste. You will get two chalk paste singles that are the new creamy, dreamy consistency and an exclusive size A transfer. You guys, I don't even know what it is. Um, 
it is going to be a surprise to us all. So it's super, super exciting. Um, and the final thing that you will always get being a Club Couture customer is you get access to exclusive offers and deals directly from Chalk Couture for being a Club Couture customer of mine. Now this month it is 15% off our Chalk It Up kits. We currently have one kit in stock and God willing, at least two more are going to be available, hopefully as early as Tuesday. Um, and the last one, it might be till the very end of the month. But you guys, there's so many good things that you get with this. Club Couture is where it's at. I'm actually going to be using a very old Club Couture transfer tonight for our Watts of Love Wednesday. So if you are interested in becoming a Club Couture customer of mine, remember I was challenged to get 20 new Club Couture customers this month. I am up to seven. I need 13 more. I would love nothing more than to add more Club Couture customers during this live. I think it would be super awesome. So if you are ready to join Club Couture, the link is right down below in the description of the video on both YouTube and Facebook. Now, the next thing I want to chat with you guys about is something that is super near and dear to me, and that is the ability to make 2021 your year to purchase your business in a box, launch your empire, and join my award-winning team. This is our new designer kit, aka Business in a Box. I call it a Business in a Box because everything you need to jumpstart your business is going to come in that box. It is a small, and I mean a small investment of $99 plus tax and shipping in the US, $127 plus tax and shipping in Canada. However, the box is going to come valued at $240 US, $330 Canadian, and it's going to include five three-ounce chalk paste, a small squeegee, an apron, a 12-pack of thank you cards, a 12-pack of chalkable chips, a board and base, a 9x12 porcelain steel Ada Magnetic Chalkboard, the Rini, our gorgeous and brand new Spring Summer 2021 catalog, six silk screen adhesive back reusable transfers from that brand new catalog, along with that Club Couture transfer. I can't remember if I said it or not, but Club Couture is so exclusive, it's only open to designers and Club Couture customers, okay? Now, I know I just threw out a whole lot of info at you. And you're probably like, Jess, you have got me beyond confused. I have got so many questions that I don't, I need them answered before I do anything. Please don't worry. I have the answers to your questions. In the link of this video on both YouTube and Facebook is going to be the link to my opportunity group. Please click it. Once you click it, I will see that you requested to join. I'll go ahead and approve you and I will tag you in my most recent opportunity video that I did last Monday that goes over all the brand new, new designer um, programs that we have going on. Once you watch that video, that should answer all of your questions so that way you can make the decision about whether or not um, you are ready for, not just for Chalk for Tour, ugh, not ready for just Chalk and Tour, but I, that you want me as your upline. I want you to be happy. So there is that. Um, now, here's a little something up on my screen for all of my brand new friends who are just joining. So that way you can see all of the awesome details all about Club uh, Chalk Couture. Let me go ahead and say hello to some friends. Hi, Kim. Hey, Lisa. Thanks for sprinkling. Hi, Maria St. P. Hey, Kristen. Hi, Rose A. Hi, Gail. Hi, Margaret Miller. Hey, Dion. Hi, Tonda. Hi, Mary Ager. Hi, Jeanette Holmes. Hi, Barbie. Hey, Val. Thanks for sprinkling, Maria. Hi. Hold on. I can't see who's saying hi. Hi, Burn. Um... Hey, thank you for sprinkling, Mary. Hi, Amy Grossman. Hey, Mary Beth. Hi, Karen. Is it really who sent that text? It was me. I promise you, Karen. It was me. I truly sent that text message. Hi, Kim Nesbitt. How are you? So, you guys, it's What's Up Love Wednesday, and it's freaking cold in New Jersey. And I'm going to just tell you, my sweater makes me look like I'm a priest. Like, if I go like this, it looks like I almost have the priest collar on. I got this sweater new, and I wanted to wear it because it's super cold here. Um, it's so cold that I actually have a giant cup, cup of Joe, a giant mug because I'm freezing to death in the basement because I call it the dungeon for a reason. It's like ice cold in here, but we're going to be doing some super, um, good things. I'm actually going to be making one, two, three Watts of Love projects tonight. Three of them. Um, Watts of Love Wednesday, if you are not aware What's Love Wednesday? We are bringing light to Malawi. We want to go ahead and light Malawi. We um, partnered with Watts of Love. And if you are not sure how you can donate to Watts of Love, there are actually three ways that you can do it. 
First way that you can do it is you can purchase our Watts of Love transfer, um, which I believe is called Old Doors. Um, and that was actually my first Watts of Love Wednesday. Eric, um, hopefully you should be getting it. Uh, hopefully in the next few days, it should be coming in the mail. Um, uh, you can purchase that transfer right on my website. $2 of every purchase of that transfer goes directly to Watts of Love. The second way that you can donate to Watts of Love is when you're shopping in my online store, maybe you don't want to get that Watts of Love transfer, or you may have already purchased it. Whenever you check out, you can always click the round up box. When you click the round up box, it will round your change up. So if your order's, I don't know, $79.11, 89 cents will round up directly to Watts of Love. It may not seem like a lot, but you guys, that change adds up. Okay. And then the third way that you can donate is you can go right to my website and click right on the Watts of Love bar and you can donate any dollar amount, a dollar, $5, $10, $25, $50. $50. And technically I guess there's four ways because you can also participate in Watts of Love Wednesday. What I'll do is after I'm done creating these projects, I'll post the pictures on my business page on Facebook um, and you can bid on them. The highest bidder will win them. You'll just go right to my website and make your donation. You don't have to worry about tax or shipping or any of that stuff. I cover the shipping to you. Um, you literally will just do the donation. So it is Ash Wednesday. I knew that. Um, thanks guys. Thanks for saying it's a cute sweater. I appreciate it. Um, so let's see. Thanks for sprinkling Roxanne. How are you? Thanks Kat. It's cold in South Carolina, too. I think everywhere it's cold. I think Mother Nature is super hormonal right now. Um, so there's that. Hey, Jenny Davis from Atlanta. So those that's a little bit about um, Watts of Love. They not only bring light to those that need it, they also bring education on how they can go ahead and use the solar-powered lights, how they can use them to charge them up during the day and not spend their money on kerosene and matches and fuel and coal and all of that stuff. Instead, they can save it to purchase things that will help bring them an income. A chicken, as silly as it may sound, they per they save the money to purchase a chicken. They can sell the eggs. Um, I guess they can produce, maybe they can let the chicken mate. I don't really know that part, but regardless, you understand. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Melissa. So let's jump. Uh-oh, what happened to my... Right, right. Hold on one second, guys. We may have an issue. No, we don't. Okay. There it goes. Okay. So this is also going to be another reason and a shout out as to why you should do um, Club Couture because I'm using, this is one of our very first Club Couture transfers. Um, this transfer was so, so cute. Um, and actually the only way that you can get this project is by bidding on it because this transfer has long been discontinued, but it was a Club Couture transfer and Club Couture is so exclusive, you guys. Um, the only way to get those transfers is to either be a designer or be a Club Couture customer. That's the only way to get it. And I'm sorry, but I love the idea of something exclusive. I think it's fun. Plus, not only that, you get all of the cool benefits that I had listed that I'd already said. Oh, Amy, uh, yeah, it's free. That's where I'm at in the basement. Oh, I think all basements in New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and Delaware are cold. Um, doing good but freezing in Ohio. I know. I hear you, Roxanne. With the bad weather tonight in North Carolina, just plan on staying. Yeah, Lisa, just stay safe. That's all that matters. Just stay safe. Yes, Barbie, she's totally bipolar. Agreed. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to paint my canvas. Um, and we're going to chalk over it. Okay. So I'm using, you guys know, I love my sea paints. It's, they're just, uh, it's just a great, um, it's a great paint. I, I, I have no affiliation with them. Um, I just know that she is a local small business and she makes this out of Florida and everything I've used with my sea paints. I just love the way that it turns out. So hence why I always use sea paints. Like I said, I have no affiliation. It's just personal preference. Um, I love the coverage that I get from them. Um, I'm trying to be super easy tonight because I'm not trying to be flicking green all over my cool new sweater. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to paint this part first and then I'll do the sides. And wait, do you see how fast this stuff dries to you guys? Like the sea paints just dry lightning quick. Whoops. What is that? Is that so what is what did everybody do today what's on everyone's agenda what is that get off 
There it goes. Uh, it's my, it's like a piece of my hair and something else. I'm not even sure. Okay. So here, I'm going to ask a question and I want you to put it in the comments down below. Who here is already a Club Couture customer? If you are already a Club Couture customer of mine, put a one down below in the comments. If you are contemplating joining Club Couture, put a two down below if you are okay with me messaging you to say hey and answer any questions you may have. Um, like I said, the link to join is down below. The, the um, ability to purchase the finished projects and make your donation for Watts of Love will be down below. Uh, or, I'm sorry, will be this the project pick will be posted on my business page and I will get off. Hold on. Um the picture will be posted on my business page and it will be open until Friday at noon and the highest bidder will win these. Okay. Okay. Just making sure it's all covered. And once this is all good, I'll turn it on its side and we will, I have, there it goes. Hair from the paintbrush was on there. Okay, let's quick dry this. Oh, oh let's see. Oh, I'm missing a bunch of comments. Sorry guys. They need them in Texas, right? Oh my gosh, seriously. I feel bad for my friends in Texas, you guys. I am seeing and hearing that there's rolling blackouts, that people's pipes are freezing and their homes are getting flooded. Um, got above 32 today, but snow next two days, bummer. We here in Texas without power and water had to go scoop up a lot of snow. Oh, Lydia, please be safe. I'm so sorry for what you're going through. Hi, I like stamping. I know we're preparing for it tomorrow too. You did nothing, Debbie Green. Good for you. It's been 30 plus below zero for us since first week of February. Today it was 15 above. Wow, Sarah. My goodness, girl. All right. I like all the ones. I got all my laundry done because I'm going away on a girl's trip this weekend. Good for you, Barbie. Cleaned up kitchen and took dog to the vet. What kind of plant is that? Uh, what plant are we talking about? Oh, what kind of paint? Christina, at sea paints. I'll message you the one I use. Hi, Carolyn Bonner. Hi, Leanne Parker. How are you guys? Um, thank you, Lisa. 78 in your hometown in Florida, Janet. Oh, I'm so jealous. See, you get online, small business floor. Thank you, Maria St. P. Pipes are all bursting. I know. I know. I, I was talking to some of the couturiers today on my uh, monthly couturier call, and they were saying they have the rolling blackouts and that they're... Their pipes are bursting, and it just breaks my heart. Just quick drying this. And once the front is dry and I feel confident in the ability to hold it and not get myself all messed up, I will flip it on the side. Like, it looks like it's dry here, but I could be... Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, let's quick do the sides, and then that way this is all painted, and it's going to be ready for us to chalk. Now, I am going to have another. This is going to be one of those li long lives that you guys all tell me you like, that you prefer me to be live for a while. This is going to be one of them tonight, you guys, because I'm doing not one, not two, but three, pro and it's all retired stuff. All retired items that I'm working with. I decided that's what I'm going to do for Watts of Love Wednesday going forward. I will be using my retired stuff because when I do my all-day chalkathons, I use retired items as well. So why not do that? And since, you know, St. Patty's Day is coming up, I figured let's make it an all St. Patty's Day theme. Okay. And I also try to make it things that are easy to ship that I don't have to worry about going to find a package to fit it or something because that could hold it up getting shipped to you and I don't want that. So there's that. I'm going to end up putting it on my counter and it's fine. We'll get it off. No big deal. Okay. 
trying to go easy, like I said, so I don't flick it across my outfit. Even though, you know, the sea paints, they're like water based. So it does come off with water. Got to scrub a little bit, but it comes off. I just don't want all my clothes. No, thanks. Okay. Last side. And then we're going to wax it and get ready to chalk it. I will tell you guys, if you bought any of our new creamy dreamy piece that has uh, just started to come back to come out, if you are chalking on a canvas, you want to wax because the creamy dreamy is more the consistency of what our ink is, our couture ink, and it will bleed. Okay. So if you don't want it to bleed, I suggest you wax. If you wax it, it should be just fine. Okay. Let's get this covered up. I didn't make too big of a mess. That's pretty good. Hi, Teresa. Montana was 17 today. Yikes. We'll hang in there with you. Thanks, Julie. How are you? Hey, Stacy Booker. Your snow reminds me of hurricane season. Oh, gosh, I know. What paint? It's not a paste. It's not paste. It's sea paint, and it's called sea turtle is the color I'm using. Florida and Hawaii are the only states that are not freezing. Thank God I'm going to Hawaii in two weeks. I cannot wait. Uh, I'm doing so good, Caroline. Glad to hear you're doing well, too. Just order a whole lot of creamy dreamy. Awesome, cat. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's dry the ends of these, of this. And my wax, I was going to say my wax is out somewhere. And usually, honestly, guys, this paint does typically dry a lot quicker. Actually, and since I'm not going to be making a TikTok of this because it's retired, let me go up to the edge. Um, usually, you guys, it's a lot faster for this paint to dry. But because, um, because uh, the basement's so cold, it takes a little bit longer. Okay, I think we're good. It's good enough. It's good. All right, so let's get our wax and let's go ahead and let's wax this. Rub it in. Yes. <laughs> Mountains in Hawaii have snow. What, Sarah? Don't tell me that. Uh -huh. Now, what are we going to do with the old chalk paint? I don't know about the chalk paint. Do you mean chalk paste, Julie? It still works. It's still good. Um, that's And thank you. Yes, Stacey. That's exactly what I'm doing. I'm using it. I'm use, I always use up mine. Um, until it's gone. Um, so that's what I'll be doing. I won't be using any new until I'm ready to. I don't like wasting, especially my chalk stuff, you guys. I don't like to waste at all. Okay. So, oh, I did not, did I not get out black velvet? Hold on. I need black velvet. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's use some shimmer shadow tonight. Let's use some shimmer shadow and some shimmer gold for this. Where is it? Okay. So this transfer says, thank you for the help with the, oh, no problem, Dopey. Thanks, Mary. Same on the lame on the nature's right now. You never know, right, Kristen? Oh my gosh, I know. Yes, use it. Yep, there it goes. Okay, making sure I answered all of you guys. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and peel this off the carrier sheet. And I'm going to go ahead and place it down. And you guys, I feel like I just totally put that in the center. Totally did a great job doing it, I think. Okay, so here's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to do the little dots in the shimmer shadow. I'm going to do who needs luck when you've got this much charm in shimmer gold. And then I'll figure out a color. I wonder how shimmer harvest would look on this. I'm not entirely sure, but it might look pretty good. We'll see how shimmer harvest looks. For the little, what are they called? Shamrocks. All right, so let's do this. Ready? Hi, Anita. I'm super sad I lost my surface wax somewhere in my craft hole. Oh, no. Absolutely. Yes, Dion. Totally. Totally. Yeah. Use it all till it's gone, you guys. Don't waste. Okay. Do we agree that I should do, should I do the dots actually in Shimmer Gold? And who needs, who needs? when you've got this much how about i do shimmer gold shimmer gold shimmer gold black shimmer shadow shimmer shadow 
Yes, that's what we're going to do. I just answered my own question. Okay, so we're going to do our shimmer shadow first. And I'm going to just gently apply pressure to the transfer because, you guys, this transfer is way old. I have way more than used my 12 uses. It owes me nothing, but I will not get rid of it. Not going to happen. Because if you don't know, our transfers are good for um, 8 to 12 uses. Okay, they're reusable. I don't even remember what I said I was going to do. Oh, this, that's right. Trying to be careful, but you guys know me. I'm not usually careful. But when it's for someone and someone's going to bid generously on it. Um, oh, I just stuck my finger right in that. Uh, I want to make sure it looks nice. If it's for me, I don't mind if I go off or smudge the colors a little. It's not a big deal. I like rustic and distressed. So if I make a mistake, I just call it rustic and distressed. No biggie. Okay, so get that excess back into the jar. Got to dig for a squeegee here. Got plenty of them now. I just got, I'm trying to find my mini guys. My fingers are not deep enough there. Okay, so let's grab some shimmer gold. I think this is going to turn out really pretty, you guys. Very festive. Uh-oh. I see a little splotch of shimmer shadow that I'm probably going to... Yep, I did. I knew it was going to happen. And remember when you bid. Bid generously, you guys. This is going for people who need it. That is for sure. Make sure I got everything. It's a little hard. I should be using a towel underneath this because a canvas does not have any give. And sometimes you need to be able to push to get your color through. And I can't exactly do that with this. Okay, I think I got that all covered. Let's get our little shamrocks on. Go for another small squeegee. Or mini squeegee, rather. Hopefully this color looks good. If not, I'll just go over it with a different color. I'm really not worried. I just don't know how it's going to look on top of the green that I did. You know what I'm saying? Oh! Hold on one second, you guys! Hi, <laughs> how are you? Yes. Awesome. Okay. Don't mind me, I'm live, <laughs> but nobody knows who I'm talking to. Yeah, my people know this happens sometimes. <laughs> All right, that sounds good. All right, thank you. It's fine. Bye. Bye. Sorry, guys, that was a friend that I'm trying to do something for. Okay, so look at that. It looks so cute. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Do you love it? Do you love it? Do you love it? It's so funny because I was just thinking of her. 
I was just thinking of her. What do you guys think? It's just a perfect mistake. It's all it's not Chris. <laughs> until um, it's gone. I'm super sad. I love, oh, I think I read that already. Shimmer Olive, Shimmer Harvest. Yes. What do you guys think? When you go to Maui, go to the top of Halika Kala Volcano. Bundle up if you do. Yep. I will probably not be doing that because I'm not going to bring any warm clothes. I'm going to be on the beach where it is nice and hot with the sand in between my toes. Okay, so how cute does this look, you guys? Oh, I love it. Now I'm wondering, hold on. Ooh, I have an idea. I have an idea. You guys tell me what you think. Like I said, I want to make this where you guys are like, yes. Let's bid up on this since it's for a good cause. What if we open this box? I love it. Oh, awesome, Leslie. Welcome to Chalk Couture. You'll love it here. You will love it here. There's so many designers that love to share what they do. Okay, here's what I'm thinking, and you guys tell me what you think. What if I take... Ah! Ah! Okay. We're dropping. Big surprise. We're dropping... Okay, one, two, three, four, oh, oh, oh my goodness, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, because seven's a lucky number, right? Let's put seven little beads at the top of this and make like a little rope thing, even though you can hang it up because the canvas is like deep enough. Okay, I just think it will be super cute. Okay, so let's, there's twine. Okay, let's get these over here. Let's grab a piece of twine. Ah, and remember our little tip. You guys, we're going to get our placement tape and we are going to tape up Oh, Cindy, thanks. Yours went out. You were my Watts of Love winner from last week. Eric Scott was my first one. And Cindy, you were, I believe you were, you're the Cindy that won last week's, right? Yours went out. So you should be getting it too. Very, very soon. I appreciate you guys supporting Watts of Love. It's very near and dear to me. I will tell you, you guys, I have my one piece that spoke to my heart. And I went up and said I would do a rather obscene donation for it because it reminded me, reminded me of the day that little Bram was born. And I wanted to have it so that way I could have it forever and always think of that. Hi, Tracy. Yay, Cindy. Awesome. Thank you so much for your donation. And I hope you love it. I did put a little note on the back. Oh, this one's going to be too tight. Oh, no. I lost my placement tape inside this one. <gasps> no. I am going to do a little bead hanger. Uh-oh. Womp, womp, womp. My fingers, my nails are a little too chunky to dig this out. I'll force it out. Ouch. Or not. It's fine. And I don't have tweezers, so we'll just make another little loop around it. Um. <laughs> oh, it's funny. All right. So... Let's keep on going. We're going to tape this one. I don't know what keeps happening to my very strange hat. It keeps disappearing. There it goes. Okay. Ready? Let's do another piece of placement tape. And maybe I will save this bead for the last one since it's super, super, super tight. I don't want to try to push another bead through yet. There we go. I really want to do seven because, well, you know, seven like a lucky number. All right, let's attempt it again. Oh, look, I pushed it out. Yay. 
Okay. So even if it's like a cute little beaded hanger, what do you guys think about that? I know it's not the same green, but it's still green, right? Still green. What do you guys think? It's cute with the swag of beads in the corner. Do you know what I mean? Um, yes, but I think it's gonna co it'll cover it up. I think. I just did that with a um another project that you guys will be seeing as soon as I get it in stock. I will launch it as a bundle. I can't. I just can't because I know my other bundle, my bundle box. It's it just shipped. Oh wait, no, no, the bundle box didn't even just ship yet. Um, my order from the second shipped. So, um, I don't want to ship this until I, I, I don't want to launch it until I have the product in my hand and until the other bundle box goes out. Cause that's just the way I am. Oh, thanks guys. Oh, cat girl, you know, I'm, I am just me. It's all I can say. Okay, so we're almost done getting this. Oh, I forgot to plug in. I forgot to turn the glue gun on again, guys. So we're going to have to come back to gluing this guy on. Okay, but look. How cute is that going to be? I'll glue it like... I got to cut the strings, obviously. Obvi. But we'll put it like right like that. Wouldn't that be so cute? And then look what else I have. I got these from Dollar Tree. I was thinking... If these didn't turn out, I could put them over it a little or something. I could put the little pieces off to the side or something to that effect. Look. Actually, I don't want to do the gold coins. I forgot I'm saving them for a different project. So, like, I could put little pieces stacked up or something like that. And, well, we need to do it in groups of threes. Hello. Hello threes are pl more pleasing to the eye. What if we did something like that? Do you guys like it? When do you leave on my trip? Mary, I leave March the 1st at 6 a.m. for Hawaii. You guys love it? Okay, so we'll come back to this one to glue these things on once my glue gun heats up. So let's move on to project number two. In the meantime, like I said, we're going to have three projects up for grabs tonight for Watts of Love Wednesday. Okay. All right, so I got another cute little surface that I found. Um, and this transfer was not a Club Couture transfer, but I just thought it would be so sweet to put this on here. So we're going to do that. Hold on, I need some coffee. You guys, my fingers are numb. It's that cold. It's so crazy. And this is the very beginning. Did you treat the canvas after painting it and before chalking it? I did wax it. Um, I painted it, then I waxed it, and then I did the transfer. Okay, so we've got so lucky. Did I put that on? Oh my gosh, I just stuck that down. Didn't get stuck, thank goodness. All right, we'll put this to the side so I can take it to the back to clean it. Okay. Um, so... Let's get this going. Okay. Now, this is like just a cheapy little sign from Dollar Tree. Okay. But we're going to snazz it up with this. Okay. I can get it off. And I'm not going to fuzz it up because this is another one I used a lot. This retire transfer. I can't even remember when it was actually out. Okay, so what my goal is going to be is to get all of the letters to not be on the yes. Right there. And I'll probably do the little shamrock there. I'm going to do this, I think, in the I think I'm going to do the words in shimmer gold and then I'm going to do lucky, so lucky right across or I don't know. I'll figure that out in a different color. So let's do this in shimmer gold. Okay. Thank you for uh, sprinkling, Cindy. I'm going to do shimmer gold. I'm going to do shimmer gold. I think that's what I'm going to go with. I just think it'll look super pretty.
Uh oh. I have something underneath the silk screen. Under my S. So hopefully it didn't bleed. Hopefully it did not. Okay. I'm having like problems feeling my squeegee because of how cold my hands are. I've been down here all day working, so that's probably why. Oh, rot row. Hold on. Why? Hold on, I need, need a little bit more. There we go. I think I did not use enough paste down here for this, so I'm going to rub a little bit more on and then push it through. There it goes. Oh, good. Even where I had the little bump, you can't even tell it. Yay. Awesome. So cute. Okay. So let's put this to the side with the other one. <gasps> my bean is on, you guys. Can you guys all throw hearts for the bean? My little bean is here. He says, hi, Aunt Jess Rex. Hi, bean. I miss you. Aunt Jess misses you so much. Oh, I miss you, sweet boy. My big sweet boy who's losing his teeth. He's got visits from the tooth fairy. Are you ready for the snow bean? I miss you, buddy. This must be an, it is Anita. I'm doing Watts of Love Wednesday with all older transfers. Ah, You some Irish in? <laughs> hi, Aunt Peggy. Well, hi, Peggy. As little Bran would say, Aunt Peggy. So there's that. Oh, look, everybody's saying hi to the bean. You guys know the bean. He likes to come on and do videos with Aunt Jess or X. Hey, bub, come say hi on my video. The bean's on and Aunt, and Aunt Peggy. Hold on, this is for the bean. Hello. <laughs> Aw. Thank you, Anita. I love you too, Peg. I miss you. I don't even close. You don't wear. Uh, you don't wear clothes or anything. <laughs> Wait, I read that wrong. I'm Irish and I don't decorate or wear Irish clothes. I said you don't wear clothes, and I apologize. That was a slip of the tongue. Yay, Peg. Good. I will hold you to it. I think everybody would love to see the bean on. Everybody would love that. Okay, hold on, you guys. I'm thinking I should have probably done the So Lucky first and then done the Irish Blessing. So you know what? We're going to save that for another one. And we're going to do... What's that, babe? Thanks, pal. Um, You know what I think I'm going to do? I'm going to steal the shamrock from this one. Because this shamrock is super tiny. Unless I do... Th I could do three of them, actually. Let's do three of them. That would be cute. And we'll do, uh, we'll do it in the uh, Shimmer Harvest, right? They wave the same time. Oh, how cute. Oh, the beam waved to you, bub. He said, thanks, bean. Okay, so we got our one. Oh, I don't know if, I, if I'm liking that. I might have to redo this in deeper green. You love the green glitter along the edge? I do too. It's super cute, right? And let's see if that, I'm going to, I'm just eyeballing the space, you guys. I don't even know if it's the right amount of spacing. We'll see. Okay. 
Okay. That sort of looks pretty good there. We're going to go with it. And then we're going to have Project 2 done. Green ribbon here. I don't think I do. That's pretty good for eyeballing it. Not bad, Miss Wilson. Not bad. Not bad at all. It is shimmer. Oh, did I say shimmer harvest? I meant shimmer olive. I'm sorry. I meant shimmer olive. I always do that. Oh, I have some cute green. Oh, let me see. Mm, no, I don't like that. We're not going to use that. I do not have any fun green ribbon that will match. It's like. It's not green, green. And I feel like I need some green, green. Oops. We're knocking over pom-poms that I had from last night. Okay, it's okay. You know what? We're going to leave it like this. It's fine. Sometimes less is more, right? So there's that. So we've got this one is project number two. This turned out so cute. Oh, okay, and good. Guess what? We're going to come back to this guy because this one, and my glue is, is ready. All right, so I'm going to set the cute little shamrocky guys at the bottom like this. Hopefully, they don't melt because they are styrofoam. Okay. And awesome. Here's all the glitter. Yay, you guys know how I love glitter. I don't love it in case you didn't pick up my sarcasm. If you're new here, I hate glitter. I hate it. Reason behind it, yes, I am a crafter, and some people are like, um, that's sacrilegious to be a crafter, not like glitter. I am a contact wearer, and what happens is I forget that I've touched glitter, or I've washed my hands for the umpteenth time, and no matter what, the glitter stays. It stays with you. It's like the clap. It doesn't go away, okay? And sorry, I'm just saying, I probably shouldn't have said that live, but it's the truth. Um, I always forget, and I will touch my eyes throughout the day. It's just a bad habit that I have. Like, I don't know, I think it's like a, when I'm a ner nervous type thing, like my nerves. Um, and I forget, and I touch it, and then I have glitter on my contacts, so that's not, that's no fun. Okay, so I'm just going to eyeball this, you guys. Just gonna eyeball it up. We're gonna go with it. Okay. Hi. <laughs> yep, Court, I said it. <laughs> like I said, probably shouldn't have, but I did. Too late to take it back. Too late to take it back. Hopefully this is going to be centered. I hope I did it centered. I'm going to cut, I'm going to trim off the excess twine too. I'm a florist by trade that used to be covered in glitter from Halloween to Mother's Day. Oh, Barbie. I can only imagine. I know. I can't believe I said that either. Oh, oh my gosh. I know. I said it. I probably shouldn't have. Oh, maybe I'll delete this line. get this off okay so now we have two projects done for Watts of love yay all right so this did come out super cute you guys if you don't bid on this i'm keeping it i'll do my own donation if you if nobody bids on this okay oh look at that it's so cute okay so we've got two projects done let's move on to our third now this one is another little hanging thingy. And I remember I said I wanted to use the gold coins for something. I think I'm going to draw like an imaginary line like right across here. And I want to paint this black except for that part. I staple mine to back now with large stapler. Ah, oh, good call, Cindy. Yes. They need an edit button on Facebook Lives. I know. <laughs> well, thanks, Barbie. 
I aim to be comical. Um, I work with a girl that hates glitter. We always give her the glitter stuff to price. Oh, Court, that is evil. That is way evil, girl. Oh my gosh. All right, so I am picturing this to be like the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Um, I th Was I with Big Brand? I don't remember who I was with when I bought it. And we were like, it looks like beer bubbles. <laughs> Which it could make sense because, you know, you drink a lot when you're when for St. Patty's Day. Like, that's the thing, right? I mean, thanks, COVID. We won't be doing that. But we used to go to our local Irish bar, Clancy's, all the time for St. Patty's Day. All the time. And like I like I said, I'm not super concerned about um, going off onto my countertop. I this this sea paints I can get off with water, you guys. Okay, so now, homie, I'm not a straight hand. Hold on. Let me at least pick up the extra wet stuff. Okay. I'm going to imagine that right about here. Or should I go higher? Let's start in this area and let's see what happens. I kind of feel like it needs to be brought up to about there. Do you guys agree? Would you guys agree with that? Oh, more entertaining than a TV show. Yes! Give me my own! I need a reality show. Hey, Eggla! It is cold, and we are due to get snow. Um, last I checked... I'm going to go with it, guys. Last I checked, we were in the 8 to 10 inch area. I don't know how true that is. that statement is now because, you know, it changes in, in a second. Okay. I think I'm quite satisfied with how this, where I did that. Okay. Now, my gold paint is not here with me. So you know what I'm going to paint with? Our shimmer gold chalk paint. Chalk paste. Our shimmer gold chalk paste. What did I do with my other? There it goes. We're going to paint with it. Okay. Oh, I hope I brought another brush home. Yes, I did. Fantastic. Okay. So, let me be careful so I don't lean into the wetness of the paint. Okay. Let me get a color tray out got a sticker on it. All right, let's try this. We did not lose power yet, but I know um, some people, on, I think someone just commented that they lost the power. Who was it? Someone just commented in the thread. You're in Arkansas and we're on our second eight inches of snow, 17 inches total. Oh my gosh, Christina, just be safe. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. I just smeared a ton of ink right here. I don't know how I managed to do that, but we'll get it cleaned up. No big deal. Just going to quick dry this. Okay, now let's 
get some shimmer gold out of here. <gasps> Jesus. You guys. Oh my goodness. Um, hold on, I'm trying to reach a stir stick. Okay. So we're just gonna get out a little bit of paste. Okay. And what I'm gonna do is add water to it so I can water it down because I want it to be like a paint and not a paste, right? So I need to add some water to it. Okay, what do I do with the brush? Oh. Okay, so I could have sworn I cut this off. I think maybe I cut it off the other one, but. And I need to untie this. So I can fully paint. Really? Sometimes they get these knots like really, really tight. I feel like I'm making like some headway and then I can't undo it. Just come undone. There it goes. Okay. Whew. Okay. Got it. Finally. All right. So let's go ahead and let's paint this, shall we? Oh, that looks so good. Good amount of shimmer gold. Did you know that you could paint with our chalk? Oops, I went a little over. A little over. No biggie. It's okay. It's really okay. Oh, look at that. Can you guys see it? Can you see the shimmer? And we're going to add to it too. Now, hold on. What I'd like to do is get some of my white sea paints and get a really thin brush, which I have another one of. Do I have a sponge brush? No, oh, why would I still have a sponge brush here? I, of course I would have taken them all with me. Oh, wait, no, hold on. Of course the, oh. Here we go. I'm gonna get some white paint and I'm gonna do like just some dashes. Yes, I should be using a chalk marker, but I don't know where the white chalk marker is. I think it is at the store. It's right on my big chalkboard there. So I'm just gonna do like some I don't know what you would call it. I used to do it when I scrapbooked all the time. Um, so I'm just going to like, I'm hoping this is going to look right. I'm just going to do like some, just like some dash, just some little like, you know, shading, I guess you could say. Just to give it some depth. You know what I'm saying? This is not exactly the brush that I would have used for it, but it'll work. Honestly, this is for sure where a chalk marker would have come in handy. So all I'm going to do is just come along 
my hand does not want to drag the way I would normally drag it. And just add some to make it have like depth and dimension. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't have to be perfect, clearly. You don't need to have straight lines. Nothing's, nothing is on point with this. Okay, like it's, Okay. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, girl, no, I don't ever. I fly by the seat of my pants. If you have not <laughs> seen that already, oh, you are you are in for a treat. Eggly, you've watched me before. You know I don't ever have a plan of attack. Ever, ever, ever. And I forgot that the gold was wet and just put my whole hand into it. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, I love it. <laughs> oh, it's perfect. It really is, you guys. I love it. And then I sort of feel like we need to have like just I'm trying to think if I were like an angle. Well, let me finish up here first. Are any is anybody on here like one of my old scrapbooking customers? Do you guys remember when I would do the dashes for everything? Like, it was like my jam. It's kind of like how I feel about this. And now I feel like it just needs like, I feel like I need a shadow of some sort. What do you think? Should I go with like, no, cause I'm going to chalk it. What am I doing? Yeah, no, no, no. That's good. That's good enough. Okay, now let's dry it. And of course, because it's it's wood and it's painted, I need to wax it. Oh, it's so cute. You guys, this is we're at over an hour now for my live. Wow. I think we're dry. All right, let's wax this. Goodness, I have a mess to clean up. I need to get with the program because I got meetings tonight. Okay. I'm just going to wax right inside here because this is where I'm going to be putting my saying. Okay, we're good with that. Yes, right, scrapbooking? Yep, Fern, you remember. I used to do it all the time. That's right. You were with me. Oh, my coffee is getting cold. Okay, so let's come back to this one. I'm lucky to love you. This is way old, you guys. This is back. Gosh, oh, my goodness. This is pre-launch. I'm pretty sure this was from pre-launch. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's get it over here. Lucky to love you. All right, let's get it cut. Come 
on shamrocks come up just a little bit there we go okay let's get this back now we definitely need to wax this guy because well i clearly never used it before i think in my defense i got this like i may have i don't know bought this from somebody i don't know oh nice christina i'm looking for a gnome punch from scrap i didn't see him anywhere oh no not me mary not me okay you ready oh boy this is gonna be too long so we're not gonna be able to do all the big fancy L's or the big fancy Y okay but otherwise I think it's gonna fit great and I think I'm gonna do bright white I think we're gonna make a bright white or should we do should we do should we do meadow? What do we do meadow? Let's do meadow because this is a pretty green. Can I use all my open squeegees already? Why did I put them inside here? I cannot reach them. Here we go. My fingers are just not long enough. Okay. Ooh, I almost wore it. Went a little too crazy with mixing. Okay. Let's see how this looks with the... What's this? I think it's meadow I used. Looks like meadow. If this doesn't look right, I'll go over it in bright white, I think. There we go. <gasps> no, it looks great. Oh, it looks so good. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Now, we're not even done with it yet. We got to add to it. We've got to add to it. Let's put that to the side. Okay. Well, I've just got a gigantic mess here, you guys. Let's just close up our jars so my paste doesn't dry out. Okay. My glue gun's still on, so that's a positive. Okay stuff together. Oh my gosh. Clothes. Ah! Flinging my little letters across the room. Okay, there it goes. All right. Now, remember I said I had these cute little gold things? I think what I want to do is like maybe randomly put them on here. Like maybe a stage them like this what do you guys think do you guys think yay or nay What do we think? Yes, it was before you, Kat. Hi, Eileen. How are you? Me too. My mom and I just did a retreat this year. Just her and I for two days. It was awesome. Oh, nice. Put shamrocks with them. We can do that. Like that. Is that what you guys want? Is 
Is that a yes? I see Maria St. P, then a shamrock next to two. A little mini shamrock? Like a little guy? Oh, he's really little. Come on. Oh, they're super teeny tiny. Like that? Add shamrocks to fill the space. I can do that. So like something like this. I don't know if I care for all those shamrocks. Piece of gold down on the right foot down here. Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. Like it's dropping? Next to yes, others no. Okay, yeah, I agree. I don't I don't think I care for all of those. I think maybe just just like this. Maybe and I could do I could do I don't I'm not I'm not mad at the little ones like that. What do we think? Yes, that's cute. Okay. Okay, and then the one, the little guy next to two. Do we mean two over here? Or do we mean the two like up here? Where Where do we mean? For this one down below, do we mean above two or to the left of two? Yeah, I think maybe just like that many shamrocks. I feel like I'm saying I'm this many years old. You guys agree? Do we like? I'll sip my coffee while I wait. The way I had it. In that blank space. So right here. Okay, above. Okay. Okay. Awesome. Well, guess what? That's going to be the first one we put down. Okay. And then we'll just glue the rest of these guys down. Just to have a little bit of something. Ugh, there's all the glue boogers. Okay, so then... Ooh, well, I'll just glue it back on. That's fine. I forgot that. That looks good. I think that looks so cute. Need a third small shamrock? We can do that. I knew you guys were going to say that. Yep. Visual. Hmm. How about right there? Or should I do it, like, clump it up over to the side here or something? Because I do have the three shamrocks to make my triangle. And I'm using an odd number, which is also good, instead of above it all. I don't know what you mean by instead of above it all, Karen. Fill me in on what you mean by that. And in the meantime, I'm going to glue my little hanger back on. All these little glue boogers. Okay. Okay, how's that? Where I had it first. 
Clump it to the side. Okay, got it. Clump it to the side. You've got it. So we'll clump it right off here. How's that sound? cute you guys thanks C wheeler she said have gold touch black pot oh who said have gold touch black pot well oh how about like ooh. well you mean like make it look like it's falling? Crud. Oh, good. It came off. Should I take... Oh, I can't get that off. Where... Huh! Let's see. Who said... I think gold needs to touch top of black pot. Well... Womp womp. I messed that one up. So we... Sorry about that. I, I totally missed that comment. But you know what I'm going to do, though? In the meantime, I don't like how I had it, so I'm going to make it go like this instead now. And, of course, this is just not wanting to stick now. There we go. Okay, that's it. Yay! All right, so here are our three Watts of Love auction items. We've got, I'm so lucky to love you. Oh, it's so precious. We've got, who needs luck when you've got this much charm with our cute little green bead hanger. And we've got the little Irish blessing. So tonight's theme for Watts of Love clearly is St. Patty's Day. Okay. Oh, thanks, Aileen. Thanks, Melissa. Thanks, Egla. So that is that, you guys. I'm going to go get these, get pictures taken of these. I will have them up on my Facebook business page. The begin, um, you can go ahead and start bidding as soon as you see them up. And then um, bidding will end at noon on Friday. Be generous in your bidding. I, I, I would be very appreciative if you would be. Remember, you don't have to pay any of the shipping. I will take care of that. You just... Make your donation um, to the winning bidder. And um, yeah, that's that. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you like seeing an old Club Couture transfer come into use. Um, remember, Club Couture is really where it's at. I would encourage you, if you are not one of my Club Couture customers yet, please become a Club Couture customer this month. There's so many good things that come along with it. Um, if you need the details, just message me. Um, otherwise, I'll be back tomorrow with another fun project. Um, yeah, if you're in a snowy area right now or an area that's getting weather, please be safe. Um, stay warm if you can. I will be thinking of you guys and hoping that you will be able to. Um, but that's all I got. So have a great night, you guys. I will talk to you later. Bye. Oh.